Discussion with, the, with your with the governor of Delta State. Excellency, you know your reputation precedes you on the fact that the party, the country, is always first in your own mind. And ever since this party, when the projects, assignments has to do with ensuring the unity of the party, you've always been called upon. We felt that it is need for you also to share with you what we've been trying to do since we started meeting. That you should be part of it, you should be aware of it. As you know that the four of us will be meeting, and we have come up with this idea that for the interest of the party, that we should come together and look at the consensus arrangement. Because we believe that what the country needs today is unity. And we cannot be saying that if for ourselves do not act in that same manner. We're all eminently qualified to lead this country. But we believe that this time only one person will lead. And that person needs everybody to make Nigeria better. Needs everybody to fix this country. And I should be showing that our interest is second to that of the country. And for somebody who has always shown that as well. That's why we have come here. This is our first visit to the southern part of the country. Also to show that this consensus arrangement is not just about the issue of the North, it's about Nigeria. And to carry along a way as that's what we intend to do. We shared our thoughts with you and you've also given us your own ideas on what we need to do. I want to assure you once again that we're very committed in this exercise that we're doing to ensure that one of us will have a rule come out under this consensus. We are committed to this process. And we also hope that we also have some aspirants too, also who are still thinking about it and also look at this consensus arrangement too. So that at the end of the day, the PDP will be united and will provide leadership to this country. Because where the country is today, we need to fix it. We need to tackle the issue of insecurity, unemployment. And to do that, it can only be that we are all united as well. So we thank you for the advice you've given, your thoughts, and I want to assure you that we are really committed to this. And hopefully, we will all be successful in this, and that Nigeria will continue to now start to see a greater future, a better future ahead. Thank you for receiving us, Jason. Thank you very much. You've started to meet together to think about the, 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 the best way possible uh, for us to get out of the very difficult situation that we find ourselves as a country is very heartwarming. I, I truly want to thank you for uh, putting yourselves together and starting this journey of trying to uh, educate the rest of us uh, from across various states 
on the need for us to build a consensus uh, because I believe that that will reduce the acrimony and help to position us as a, as a party at uh, the PDP to truly compete favorably and win the 2023 elections. There is no doubt that God has been God has favored us uh, and placed us in a good position to be able to win the elections. But we need to also take some uh, human actions that will enable us to give strength to ourselves. Uh, this action that four of you have taken uh, today to cause this visitation in the south and having also visited some of our brothers in the north is actually a step in the right direction. It will strengthen us, it will tend to pull us together, and it is a prayer that God will help you to be able to achieve uh, uh, this consensus that we seek to build. Because in that consensus, we will be united as a party, it will give strength to us, uh, it, it will also give a lot of hope and encouragement to Nigerians uh, as to the fact that truly uh, the, the PDP is walking the talk, it's, it's very important. So I, I truly want to appreciate you for this visit and to urge that you continue to uh, work hard towards uh, the building of this consensus and actually uh, the building of the party because as you build this consensus across the nation, you're also building the party, the PDP, and preparing us uh, to be in a good state to be able to uh, truly compete favorably and win. And I, 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 I think that uh, this is the kind of thing we need at the moment. We only have this month of April and part of May to be able to do all of this. I know that it's quite a lot of burden on you, uh, but as you take this step forward, uh, may God give you the strength uh, to be able to truly uh, engage the rest uh, of our brothers across this nation, both in the north and in the south. And uh, uh, we hope that at the, at the final end, uh, we would uh, be in a place to say yes, we are strengthening the PDP, we now have a platform that can truly, we can actually stand on to compete, and that we are better positioned than the other political parties to truly win the elections. Uh, I, I believe that Nigerians, Nigerians are waiting to see what the PDP will do, uh, and I believe that even before we get to a level of consensus building. This action that you've taken uh, would definitely uh, touch the hearts of a lot of Nigerians and, and provide a, a beacon of hope for them. So we thank you for the action you've taken and we pray that God will lead you in your journey to other states uh, of this country. Once again, I want to welcome you to Delta State and to let you know that you have our support in this uh, step that you've taken to build consensus uh, as regards the presidential uh, race. Thanks for checking out Symphony on YouTube. Please be sure to subscribe and like our videos for updates.